Welcome to Spirituality 101. We're talking about the heart chakra today. And just know, I love you more than a nigga love his barber. All right, let's get to it. So when it comes to this heart chakra, you know, right here, you feel what I'm saying? Some people got their hearts over here, which is really odd. But this is the empathy feeling. And for you to elevate in life, you had to unlock this. So that means you had to have a heart for good people and bad people. And when it comes to choices, you have to start using your heart. So for example, if somebody is fucking you over, if somebody is putting you down a low frequency, if somebody's talking down on you, do not fight fire with fire because you have to understand karma is a thing, whether you believe it or not. The more good you put into the air, the more good will come back. The more you put bad into the air, it will come back. So therefore you have to have the heart for some people who don't have the heart for you. You have to start being empathetic towards anything and everything in life. So you see an ant, don't kill that ant because what if somebody was taller than you and they wanted to step on you? Would you want them to kill you? No, so don't kill that goddamn ant. You feel what I'm saying? Meditation can help you open this up, especially guided meditation, because once you are within yourself, you are able to let the frequencies flow within your body. As a matter of fact, speaking of frequencies, 432 hertz, 555, 832, all these different frequencies are able to help your heart chakra open up as well. Another way to open up your heart chakra is journaling. Once you start journaling and you start believing what you are writing down, this will help heal you and this can help guide you to the goals and aspirations that you are writing down. So for y'all that are writing in your journals, you have to write these things down like you already have it because you do. So if you want to be somewhere in life, write in your journal like you literally have it. Like it's literally in your DNA. It's right there in your face, but you have to believe that. And this can help you have a balance within life. If you don't know that your heart chakra is blocked, this is because you don't know the signs that the universe is trying to give you to help heal these things that you tried to hide behind. The heart chakra can be blocked by grief. You don't have purpose in life. You're not happy with the things that you achieved, nor the possessions that you already have. You are scared of being emotionally attached to people, places, or things. You are afraid of commitment in a relationship. And another way it can be blocked is if you become vengeful, angry, if you want revenge, you are downplaying your partner in a relationship. These things can block your heart. And on top of that, if you don't have a balance with your divine masculine and feminine, this will definitely block your heart chakra. When it comes to life, we are all one of the same creator. So if you sit here and think you're above somebody, think again, my brother, because you are not. No matter what people are doing, you have to love them regardless. No matter what they say or what they do, because people are programmed. They don't know what they're talking about. So you have to forgive them because they have been forgiven. Just like you want somebody to, to forgive you, forgive your brothers and sisters. I love you. Hope you have a great, wonderful day.